TJ, wow. that's not enough. I use a thirty sauce, cow nugget. I use a sauce packet per three nuggets. Yeah, you know what I mean? going on? All right, let's switch gears. This week's bucket list. Heather and I are looking for some great burritos right here in central Arkansas. So, you know, last week, you know, it was Cinco de Mayo. We actually landed there on the right day. Take a look at El Porton. All right, we're back on AY's bucket list, and it is all burritos and enchiladas. And I got my boy DJ with us today. Yeah, I'm in the house. Now, I know the dates wise, it is actually Cinco de, I mean, Cinco de Mayo, Mayo yes. here today. So, we're going to have fun with that. But right. a big time restaurant. Apparently, you say you come here a lot, right? All the time. But if you haven't checked out this one's AY, we have a full bucket list of everywhere you need to go for burritos and enchiladas, but it's time to get in here and eat. And here we are, Cinco de Mayo. You know we got to have our drinks. And uh, Heather, you said y'all got something special going on too with AY, right? Oh, yeah. It's also with burritos and enchiladas on the bucket list. We also have tequila buns. Oh, so you know what that means. Right. They brought out a nice little flight. Oh, yeah. Uh, I guess we're starting with this. Happy yeah. Cinco okay. de Mayo. Happy, happy day. Here we go. Yeah, it's a bucket list for real here today. Anyway, but once again, the food out here. It looks amazing, but y'all know me and my little eating habits, right. right? Vegan all the way. I can't let you eat all this alone. You know what I mean? What, what so, happened to DJ? You know what I did for you this What'd week? You do? You I do? called in some backup. Who is it? Oh, just wait until you see. DJ likes his sports. We have brought in our boy Troy, that is a KRK sports guy. That's right, I know. In high school, they used to call me the bottomless pit. Well, that's why. I know, look at this. Right? This is a California burrito, but it's the size of a small child. So I saw you digging great. into it. Is it good? It is already fantastic. So much cheese. That I'll get into more of that later. It looks we have so much to cover. I mean, it looks delicious. I have a chimichanga. We have chicken beef and homemade guacamole. Let's eat, yeah, Troy. I'm ready. Let's I'm go. Ready. Let's go. All right, Troy, I have to have some cheese with my cheese. This is jam packed. <laughs> with cheese goodness and chicken and I love how they lightly fry it and then I can stuck, stick some guacamole on it. Yeah, no, fantastic. Yum. And I think I know why they call it the California burrito because there's an ocean of cheese. I think you need some more it. cheese. Let me get yeah, some more cheese. Give me some, some more cheese. cheese. There we go. I am ready. Oh God, I think I know why they call this the enchilada why? supreme because it is supreme. It's got everything oh, yeah. and it tastes amazing. I can't get enough of this. If we can get a little close up, look at the presentation. It might not be much, but it's got everything I like. Tomatoes, sour cream, salt. Looks it's got so some good, meat. Troy. Oh, you got yeah. the uh, Yes, I do. And it is stuffed with shredded chicken and mm. cheese. It is so good. It is actually a lighter meal. So if you want something lighter, you can grab that and then stick some guacamole on it as well. It looks amazing. I'm it jealous. Is. I really am. Now, you didn't think I was going to let them have all the fun. I'm holding down the block. I heard it's got a kick to it. Oh, it's got a kick. But how was all this? So good. It was oh amazing. But you can enjoy this patio too. West Little Rock at El Portone. And they also have a location at Markham. Now, we have two more weeks of burritos and enchiladas. You going to join me again, Troy? I'm coming back no matter what. You got to fight here right, for it. Tune okay. in every week.